Good morning, my friends. How are you? Uh, oh, focus. How are you guys doing today? What up? It's another morning stream. I am Jay the Ontarian Sage. And we are going to take a look at the Scarlet Nexus demo today. Um, now, to give you a bit of preface, uh, I actually played through this demo the other day. Um, you get to choose one of two characters. Uh, I chose the lady character. Um, she's dope. We're going to be taking a look at the male's character today. Um, if I get through this demo um, within my time frame, uh, whatever time we have left, we'll jump into Knockout City and just chill to the end. So, um, yeah. Like anime bullshit is abound. Let's... I was lighting up. I got, I got my sweet tea I made myself. I made it earlier this week. Very tasty. Um, yeah, let's uh, switch on over to the game, shall we? It's a little loud in my ears. I remember seeing a bit about this game maybe about a year ago. Uh, just seeing the name and the character design, I was like, this, this looks awesome. So the demo, I think, went live, um, I think earlier this week. Uh, and, you know, wanted to give a shot. Uh, it feels very much like, um, like a Nier Automata. is the demo of the game so it will have differences have differences from the retail version upstream oh, mom is pulling a tray out <laughs> i'm gonna moderate while i make spreadsheets okay she's she's gonna work while work uh, uh so yes uh this is the demo of the game so we'll have differences from the retail version uh title still under development and problems may occur uh, now, when I played this demo earlier this week, I had no problems at all. The, the game supports autosave. Please do not turn off your console. Yada, yada, yada. We all know this. Fix the camera real quick. Yeah. Some data. Again, this is your very, very pretty title screen. We'll hit the any button. Uh, analytics, what is that? Yeah, boy! Subscribe to the one, two, for four months. Your icon has evolved into some new madness. Yeah, that's what we're all about here. So yeah, the analytics appear to be the firstborn child shenanigans. Um, options kind of left it all stock. It's it's aside from the difficulty, which I left on hard mode. Um, it's all just as it was. Uh, English voices, auto scroll, subtitles, which is fantastic. Um, Everything else seems to be about fine. Brightness, good controls, spectacular. So we're gonna play the game. Now I'll show you girl real quick. So Kasane Randall, scouted by the OSF. Um, she was an elite cadet at the, at the academy. Always the top of a class, cool, rational, and indifferent to others. The only person she's opened up to is her adoptive sister. She is extremely loyal to her, and she will do anything for her sister. Fights at range with a combination of ranged multi-blade attacks and psychokinesis abilities. So she's kind of dope when I played this the first time. Today we're going to be playing as Yuito Sumaragi. 
He comes from a great family who are descendants of the founding father. Uh, cheerful and optimistic, he's a young boy with an unwavering and kind heart. Uh, having had his life saved by the OSF when he was young, he was inspired to join the OSF as a volunteer to be able to save others. By its close quarters with a combination of quick sword attacks and psychokinesis abilities. So they're... Both these characters have, have to have that. We're loud in my ear. Um, both these characters have, are, are psychokinetic in, in, their, in their ability. Um, we'll discover... We'll see other, other characters in just a, a moment that have different abilities. I think one had invisibility. Uh, one had lightning. Uh, but we'll see. If he even gets the same set of characters as Kasane does. So without further ado, let's start Yuito's... Yuito's story. So tutorial. I don't know how this boy works. Your design is so fucking cool. I do like my anime bullshit games. We've got health bar down there at the bottom. Acts as like a it's like a heart monitor. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. Move. This is the final trial. I have okay. to be ready. Stop thinking. The camera's a little a little loose. More liking. His costume, like both their costumes are so fucking rad. The sword is really cool. Reminds me of the high frequency blade from uh, Metal Gear. One that Mr. Raiden uses. I can complete this assignment. I'll be a member of the OSF. Soon I'll be able to make my childhood dreams come true. Okay, so at, at this juncture in time, he's not a, a, a member proper of the OSF. Kasane was. Um, which makes sense because the backstories are different. Um, uh, all right, let's see. That's very similar. I got enemy right stick. Cool. Bam. Here we go. Let's keep this up. Right, yeah, and, and, and that purple EQ bar that you see there, it's kind of in the wave motion. Uh, that's your psychokinesis gauge. So the more you use psychokinesis, your psychokinesis, that will deplete. I want to see some sword attacks. Yuito fights using his power, psychokinesis, and with his sword. The attack range of his sword is short, but he can overwhelm enemies with his fast attacks. He attacks enemies one by one at close range. Uh, since weapon attacks, since weapon attacks with the X button slightly charges. Okay, so each attack I land with the sword, it pumps back up my psychokinesis gauge. So let's get it going. On. Oh, he that's a nice effect. I like that. That's cool. Oh. Ah uh, yes, my favorite types of dodges. Step dodges. Oh yeah. We did it. Oh he like uses psychokinesis and throws it back into the sheath. Do it. Oh, that's awesome. I appreciate that little flavor. There's a chance she would know something about her. I have uh, to make it through this. Right bumper and life. stick. Yeah. Rising slash attack. Now that's A and X simultaneously. Yes. Let's keep this up. Oh. 
dash to a sprint. Moving. The exam should be finishing up soon. The instructor always said the most dangerous thing is being careless at the end. In terms of fighting with the Psychokinesis, I actually prefer Kasane, because her her attack pattern kind of goes very well with, with Psychokinesis. It, it, it's all range, where I'm going you know, to just want to be close up all the time. There. We'll see how the follow-ups work. is going to be that's the same button control to fucking Kasane. Right, so he's a little harder to, to land hits on the enemy. Just a little bit. I can't move simultaneously. Thinks this follow-up attack. Press X or Y. When, it, when the attack lands, perform an attack by Kinesis attack by holding the right trigger, result in a powerful follow-up attack. Do it. Rush, Psychokinesis follow up attacks. Learning how to rush follow up attack and Psychokinesis follow up attack. Uh, skill increases the amount of times you can use it consecutively. Chain them together will deal heavy damage. Killed it. Right away. Um, I like how his moves look, but I actually like playing as Kasane a lot better. Her moves make more sense.
if if Yuito didn't uh, jump back every time he had to use his, his psychokinesis, um, it would make the follow-up attacks a bit easier. But we have a whole different set of characters here. You can see the characters. Yeah. This is our boy here. Looks cool. Hanabi Ichijo. Fire. Okay, Pyrokinesis is, is, is her deal. Uh, never had to pronounce that name. Gamma? Gamma Garrison? Sclerokinesis? The hell is that? Uh, Sugumi Nazar. Revoyance. And Luca Travers. Teleportation. Interesting. Um, yeah, they all have fucking really cool designs. Got a view mode? Yeah. Yeah, his, his setup is cool. Uh, the very much uh, anime girl. Reclusive anime girl. Really, every every beefy anime dude and the child that's usually the strongest motherfucker in the room. Okay, so let's let's get going. Yeah, the squad works. I like this digital uh, caution tape. The environments are real nice too. Very well mined and whatnot. So, we're all here. Captain Narukami. That Okaiba. May I ask a question? You don't have to be so formal. We call each other by our first names in the OSF so we can strengthen our bonds. Most of us don't look our age. Ranks are there just to calculate pay. The OSF only values strength. I got remember that. That's the gist of it. So what was your question? Right. Um... Wataru... Nice tea is just too damn good. Wataru is this platoon's operator. He'll direct us from headquarters. My power allows me to communicate telepathically without the system's assistance. Wataru. Up to around 500 kilometers. That being said, it's a lot of work. So join the group. Open your personal port. Wataru Frazier. Team leaders will be Nagi, Yuito, and Sugumi. Each of you, listen to Wataru's orders and move to the designated goal. Try to take down any others along the way. Retreat is allowed if you think you can't handle it, but reach your goal. Retreat That's is all. not allowed. I won't allow it. Okay. See you later. Good luck. Alright, so uh, that dude, uh, Kagero, that we had talked in the cutscene a little while ago, um, he's part of Kasane's team in her half of the demo. Um, he's nuts. His his ability is invisibility, and it's kind of crazy. So this game also operates with a skill tree. Uh, except here, it's called the brain map, and you use the BP points to give yourself the uh, recommended skills. So brain drive. We'll get to brain drive later. It's nuts. Um, enhance, and it tells you the cost here. So that requires three, three, two. Mid air attack. I think I might want that. Perfect dodge. Restores my psychokinesis gauge. That's cool. 
power up. Increases damage to attacks. How do I hit harder? I want that. What do you follow attack? Expand one. You can perform up to three consecutive power kinesis follow up attacks. Cool. And aerial dash. Oh, so he doesn't have that innately. Interesting. Kasana has that innately. And time use. Overkill. The enemy stunned by a depleted crush gauge increases XP bonus. Um, however, this doesn't work against strong foes whose HP has been depleted. Interesting. Okay. Um, you know, we'll... we'll... Do the air dash. The teams are yeah. split up, but you can use brain talk to share information. Brain talk. So the SAS is a brain to brain connection with virtual cables uh, that allow you to temporarily use your, your allies' powers. Uh, the SAS menu is displayed in the lower right corner of the screen as the little might be a little hard for you guys to see, because my, my little window here is, a little, is obscuring it just a tad. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna sneeze. Alright. So yeah, you can link up with them, use their powers to take out enemies that have weaknesses and such like that. And you can manually stop the effect by hitting the same input to activate it. In this case, we're going to need pyrokinesis by the looks of it. Yeah, barring pyrokinesis, flames engulf. Flames engulf the weapon. Essentially, fire sword. That's what we're going to do. Why don't we attack with Cool. You get this shit. Look, I don't fully know what it is just yet. Get off real quick. Cool. Alright. Getting used to it. A little bit. <laughs> yeah, that teleportation's rad. It's my favorite one so far. Literally just bamf into the face of my opponent all the time. That might be the saving grace of, uh, of Yuito here. And keep that gap close. Don't go into heavily damaged areas. Understood. I'm good at reading the air. I mean, my power is aerokinesis after all. Uh, that awkward pause was my power too. Over. Nice. Do it. Big anime bullshit. And, and even if you use uh, like your ally's power till the bar is depleted, it will come back. It'll just take a little bit of time, and all their. All, all the amounts of time it takes to come back are different. The Kanabi seems to be pretty, pretty fast. 
object attacks. Uh, these are really cool. So press LT, zoom the PK gauge um, with the attack special object, and you can do a follow up with it. Check it out. Nice oh. Yeah, right. Wow! I had no idea you could use it like that. Bam! Oh. I guess I'm getting better. So many moving parts really fast. <laughs> Don't get burned. Nice fire. You got this. Leave it to me. Next. Next. Every time you like trigger one of these things, I need your help. you get the, the person on the screen. I'm using this, Dope, like sigil pops up. This. And then just freak. A little bit of exploring, because this is an entirely different map than with Kasane's. So I will point out the names of these enemies that I'm fighting are simply just called the others. There will be some crazier shit. Oh, hey! And each one of those uh, special objects is going to have a different button prompt. Shit. Oh, this was. Let's go. This is Brain Drive. Activating Brain Drive comes with many additional effects, such as increased attack speed, reduced psychokinesis consumption, reduced lifting time for psychokinesis objects, allowing for more for more expeditious fight. The Brain Drive gauge will be displayed while it's active, and after a certain amount of time, it will automatically deactivate. When outside of battle, the brain drive gauge will deplete more slowly. You can kind of keep this going for a little bit. Um, and as you are in this state, you might have noticed there's an XP meter that popped up on the far right side of my screen. The more cool shit I do while this is active, the higher that gauge will go, which means I will yield more XP. I will get more XP at the end of each fight, which is nutty. Oh, that's cool. This is from the part fairly button mashy deal. Yet. Jump on this band. Oh, okay, so where he 
doesn't doesn't have the air dash outright. He has a double jump. That's cool. I almost used my teleportation. Fireman says no. Wonder, I can use teleport boy. Get on the other side of that fence, even though I can clearly jump over it. Do you need help? Yeah, totally can. Go, Yui That's. What the hell's going on over there? This place is incredible. The city is above and below us. It feels like I'm in a VR from a theme park I went to when I was a kid. It used to serve as the connection base to Togetsu. The city infrastructure was destroyed in an other attack about five years ago. So what you see is what remains. Togetsu is the stronghold of the Togetsu faith, right? It's kind of like a cult. Don't say that out loud. Kagura was a believer. He was even a priest at one time. What? That guy is a priest? Hey, you do realize I can hear you, right? Don't forget, our platoon's headsets are all connected. Sorry. No, don't worry about it. My parents were believers, so I just naturally became a priest. I don't care about the teachings at all. Now that Kikuchiba is like My this, parents are believers, so I naturally became a priest. I don't think that's how that works. But okay. What's that drone doing? Damn, they found us even though we were jamming them. Crows, Captain. So they sniffed us out. Goliath, everyone. I apologize for the sirens. We'll make a big deal out of this. Let's make it exciting. The city vision projectors must be broken. They're Probably go up this way any further. Scary. Yeah, it's like they're going out there. Uh, there was an enemy that I missed. We're gonna go deal with him. After, yeah. So your curatives down there, it's my light jelly. That's that's a healing item. Do you need help? Huh, the invisible walls in this game are very specific. I should be able just to jump over that stuff. Given that our fire user's name is Hanabi, which is very fitting, because I think Hanabi translates to fireworks. I think they always try to get the names, at least some sense of what they can do, what the character can do. And do the the regular sprint because it's a little too unwieldy as a full-on. This is something that people should do in the future. Don't know if it's a handicap space? It'll 3D project the handicap symbol. That's great. Light 
jelly. Let bike get some water in a minute. Not the level construction site. Throw the bike at them. Oh well. New game, a uh, new demo. How's it going, Pisces? How you feeling? Yeah. Um, I'm actually not sure when this game's coming out. Um, it's coming out this year. Let me do a. Cheeky Google. Uh, Scarlet Nexus. Please date. Oh, it comes out June 20th, 25th. We are about a month out. Maybe a little less. I'm doing alright. Uh, Jen's over there in her workstation. Doing her day job thing. So, so we, we've rather I, I've switched over to doing the to at, doing an eleven a.m. stream, Tuesdays and Thursdays now, uh, because it's gonna get really hot here in the summer, and that's gonna be miserable at seven thirty in the evening. While it's still fairly cool out now, I will stream during that time. So anime as fuck, I love it. Please, when you come out, fucking be on Game Pass. So I don't gotta pay anything for it immediately. Um, I think that'll be on a case by case basis. Um, I'm still doing. I, I still maybe want to do the two hour streams. I think that's just a good enough, a good amount of time. But we'll see. Um, certain things like for Bloodborne, we I, I've been running a little long, just because there's a lot of garbage and nonsense in that. But I I'm gonna try to keep it to a two hour time frame as best I can. Maybe going over a little bit, but maybe five to ten minutes or so. Oh shit! I was paying attention. I did not read that at all. Uh, what the fuck? I'm getting my ass in. Okay, I missed entirely what... what my, uh... tutorial on this dude was. Um, Gamma. Data point reader. Oh no, 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 no. Two points. Knockdown? Damn. Some others have a hard shell that protects their weak points. If you come across an other like this, you'll have to break its shell to reveal its weak spot in order to defeat it. Back in their weak spots where they reduce their crush, ga crush gauge. Uh, hang out with... Hang out with your... Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? You're getting... 
Which 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 Korean spot are you going to? Like my other half, my other half is sitting in the other side of the apartment. You were referring to Nigel. <laughs> So that's a perfect dodge. Time slows down like it does in every video game. Uh, looks cool. Every time. Yeah, we did it. Cool. Broke his face. Get in there. Gun bay. Never heard of gun bay. Where, uh, where in the city is it? If it's in the city at all. Thing about this game, it's it's very hard to keep track of my health. Thankfully, the AI keeps good track of it for me because it will heal me. Down here, I'm a very big fan of games that you can use your environment as a weapon. And again, I'm only pronouncing it as I see it there. So it could be Gun Bay, it could be Gun Bay, or whatever. Um, Gun Bay. <laughs> I mean, when you get there tomorrow, ask them how it's pronounced, and there you will have your answer. That's near Murray Street. Is Murray Street in Chinatown? Open up the teleport. Finish off with something else. Good combination. All right, telling me how to use teleportation, which I already know how to do it. Bam. Bam. No shit. Up. I don't think so, maybe near it though. Yeah, I, I honestly think I'm probably thinking of Mulberry Street, which I know is Chinatown area. I do not know where Marsh Street is. Jump, jump, boosh. Oh no! I boxed. Botched. There was a Korean fried chicken place that Jen and I would go to. Uh, it, 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 I think it's in K Town somewhere. I forget the name of it, but they had these um, like combination chicken bowls that you can get. I saw it in a video on Facebook once. I was like, I have to go there. Um, I'll see if I can find the name. Send it your way. It's good chicken. Focus. 
Oh, brain drive. KFC ahead of Bonchon today on Tuesday. I've never been to Bonchon. Is that is it good? Oh my god. Need to, need, need to focus up. That was fun, that was cool, I like that. It's a good one done right. Which then now leads me to believe that Bonchon uh, does not do their chicken often, often, correctly often. You have like a raw piece of chicken or something? Cause that's... That's no point though. Yes, I, I've, I've, I've walked past it a number of times, for sure. Um, never went inside, never thought, you know, never thought about going inside once, giving it a shot. But maybe. If you want to trash talk chicken places, I'm all about it. That's fun. Uh, food was lukewarm because... Ah, okay, so, you, so they did delivery. Gotcha. According to Clefornian's power, you can detect invisible enemies. Oh shit. Um, and see through poor visibility conditions. Additionally, perfect dodges are easier to execute, allowing you to trigger a more powerful read attack by performing an attack with the X button immediately after. Additional effects will be added as you strengthen your bond with Sugumi. Yeah, so that's that's kind of the kind of the point with using your allies is you create these bonds, you forge these bonds, they become stronger, which gives them more abilities to make your attacks cooler. We've gone in. Inside's pretty good. Okay, so maybe. Maybe I'll give it a shot one day. Bam. Shall we? Shut him up. Okay, every time I level up my health, uh, caps back up again. That's a good thing to put in your video game. I need you, Gemma. Oh, you Do you need help? Pause, pause. I feel like we're getting probably to the end of this demo. 
they, they've showcased everyone's everyone's power with a tutorial. favorite chicken spot in the city. I know there was a... I know there was a barbecue place that you and I had gone to, Pisces, um, years ago. I can't remember what the name of it was. Like old Country something. Barbecue is good though. He does close the gap, okay. I just wasn't paying attention in fighting. Yeah, Hill Country. Good barbecue. Teleportation is probably my favorite ability. Mm. Good. Have some, have some more jelly. What are we talking? Fast food restaurant. Uh, you know, um, both. What's your favorite chicken spot for a uh, fast food and restaurant? Why not do both? Looks so weird in this game. This is clearly a, a flower looking at it, but it's wearing like a dress or a corset or something. It's all types of Japanese. Hey. Uh, fast food, I'd say Popeyes. I'd be inclined to agree.
Sylvia's. Oh, Yuito's team is the first to the objective. Nice going. Yeah. Red hey. rooster. Never heard of red rooster. Um. Do you hear something? Sylvia's chicken and waffles. Is that Sylvia's chicken and waffles was like in Harlem or something? No. Wait. This is a major I remember hearing something about it. Like on like a Food Channel show or something. Major others are others that have killed OSF members in the past. Captain, it'll take a few minutes for the rest of the teams to arrive. This may be rough for rookies, but hold out. Both are in Harlem. Okay, cool. <laughs> we got going on. And head movement is I guess we've got no choice unnerving I'm ready. and other appeared not another and other Duncan Perry Dodges. Yeah, learning their windups is gonna be hard. Like, I thought I was clear in that one. Status things I can inflict on to bosses. This is bad. I can still fight. Right now we're making this bar kind of melt. Tablet. What does that do? Sorry for motorcycle. One of those. Opportunity. What's up, people just tuning in now? I am Jay the Ontarian Sage. Welcome to the channel. We are playing through the Scarlet Nexus demo. Uh, I just got my ass smacked. Let's regroup. That'll teach me to greet people. I can drop this shit on you again. That's I 
this. Did we do it? Are you okay? All of you stay back or you'll get a creepy hurt. hand for a monster to have a fully fleshed out hand like in a glove even. The Seto. What you got from your Kaiba? What are you doing? Kaiba's got lightning powers. Oh, now he's got a quarter staff. That's pretty dope. Our heroes have done it again. So the hero of this fight is, of course, Private Yuito Sumeraki, who took down a major other on his first assignment. Congratulations, Private Sumeraki. Let's hear from him. Thanks. How do you feel? Uh, I'm glad we were able to defeat the other. Your first victory on your first deployment. Was it satisfying? Um, uh, I can't answer you very well myself. Please, ask the commander. And Seto looks really cool. He's wearing like a suit underneath his jacket. Both Yuito and Hanabi fought very Got the tie. Well. The fact that Private Sumeragi was put under your command, Captain, must mean that the top brass thinks highly of you. That's something you'll have to ask my superiors about. We're pulling out. The mission doesn't end until we get to Suo. Keep your eyes open. Understood. The cool. That's a cool song. We're gonna, we're gonna find that on on the iTunes. Hey, thank you for playing. Yeah, that's the Scarlet Nexus demo. Congratulations, you now get a special item from for the full game. The item you get depends on your progression in the demo, so please keep your demo data. Which I will. See, so yeah, that's Scarlet Nexus. Take a quick cheeky break and then come back with um, Knockout City for the remainder of time. We'll see you guys in just a moment. <laughs>